welcome to today's vlog. It is, I don't even know what time it is. I think it's about two, half two or something like that. So, as you can see, I've probably got paint on me because I went and did some of the boys' bedroom earlier on. I thought if I get a little bit of that out of the way, there was only a little bit of paint left. So, I used what I had and I'm going to pick enough one up tomorrow so we can carry it on. Please, can you shut up with them? <laughs> TikTok. Sick and tired of TikTok. No, I'm, I'm only joking. Anyway, <clears throat> I did some washing, got some washing sorted, went and did some of the boys' room, they cleaned the car, and I don't think he hoovered inside it, did I? Did he hoover inside? Mm, I, think so. I think he just cleaned the outside. Um, and I've just hoovered all of the garden because when Aurora's in there, there is more mess on the floor then she actually gets in her mouth. So, we clean the garden. We've got the pool out because when the kids come home, it is way too hot to be doing anything apart from sitting in a nice cool pool. It's just absolutely roasting. Blue skies, tiny bit of cloud, but not a lot. Um, <clears throat> so yesterday, you'll know, I started trying to get healthy. Like, even started eating better. Any excuse that I had to get out yesterday, I did it. We were gonna go out this morning, but because I was doing the boys' room, kind of still feel like that's doing exercise, but in the house. So, we didn't go for a walk this morning, but I'm hoping that we can go in the pool for a bit with the kids, and then when it cools down later on, then we'll go for a walk once Aurora comes home from nursery, and then we can take her to feed the ducks. And yeah, it, it, it helps me, because I'm pushing the bugger, and if she's in the bugger and I'm pushing it up the hill, then, then you know, burning more calories, aren't I? So, that's what we'll do. But I am dying today because I've not exercised for, well, all the time we've been in lockdown, I've not done any exercise whatsoever. Probably a little bit with Porsche in the garden last summer, but then just gave up. So, definitely, definitely trying to um, get healthy and get slim again. I need to. I've eaten, I've indulged now for the last like 12, 13, well probably the last two years actually. All the time Aurora's been here because by the time she was born in the February we more or less went into lockdown a year later. So I didn't really go anywhere in the first year of Aurora being little because all she did was cry or she was poorer so we didn't really get to go that many places. And the, I think that winter was quite bad. I think that's when we had all of that snow. I can't remember. Anyway, I'm going to stop rambling on. I'm just going to... Just want to let you know why we've started in the afternoon and not this morning. Because I did want to take you out on a walk this morning. And I did want to start filming what I've had for breakfast. Um, I had my breakfast with Aurora this morning. I wish I would have vlogged with her actually before she went to nursery. She was so funny. So she's got this little blue suit on and pigtails in her hair and when I put pigtails in her hair she just, it's like she grows this little attitude before she goes anywhere. I keep saying today I'm not putting them in no more. She looks, she looks cute with them but she just grows a little attitude. So I says to her, you're going to nursery soon right? So she goes, I'm not going to nursery, I'm going to the shop. She's just, some of the things she comes out with is just so funny but it's kind of one of them where you've got to be in the moment where you just kind of think hold on you're two years old and you're telling me what you're doing but she is funny I think she's excited to be back at nursery today um at first she was like no no I don't want to go and then when I got to nursery she was like yay <laughs> so but yeah, so I just thought I'd fill you in as I was going to say I really wanted to like go for a walk this morning show you what I really want to start doing what I eat in a day. Um, or what I'm having for my breakfast, my dinner and tea. So it's kind of loved of meals that I'm eating rather than me trying to cheat. But I just always forget. I know I shouldn't because, you know, it's not hard to pick the camera up, is it? And just vlog, even if I'm not talking, just showing you what I'm having. But I just, I don't know what it is. I will do it. I will do it because I really do want to do it. So I'll... I'm trying, trying. Everything's kind of getting a little bit back to normal now, so um, 
be able to fit more in and do more things and we're just trying to organize what we want to do for the summer and stuff like that and um, trying to work out because the, the car company that we usually hire the car from is enterprise and last year when we were going to hire it we were going to hire it for six weeks and it was only going to cost us something like 600 pound for the six weeks so i can't i went to him last week and tried getting a quote and they wanted like two and a half thousand pounds it's like no i won't be paying that not a chance will i be paying that i mean the good thing is with their cars is that the mileage is unlimited so you can go wherever you want it's no extra and i suppose in that sense it's worth it but it's only gone up because when i was talking to the woman because i get on with the woman that we usually hire the, who takes the booking for us and she was saying like we'd, we've had to increase the prices because we've not been able to buy any new stock because of lockdown and stuff not being able to be shipped over and stuff like that so it's like well if you're going to put your price up that much i'm sorry but there's going to be very many there's going to be very many people saying exactly the same as me no i'll go elsewhere and then still not going to be able to buy cars are they so it doesn't they don't win either way but anyway i'm gonna love you and leave you because i don't want to ramble on for far too long because the kids will be home soon so we'll see what they've been up to in school aurora was not aurora vanellope was a little bit unsettled on sunday night she was getting upset saying i don't want to go to school um it's not because she doesn't like school it, she just doesn't she likes routine vanellope and you can imagine for a child they start going back to school when they've had so long off after lockdown and then they go back to school and get into a routine again and then they're off again and she's got used to being off again and then she's got to go back to school again and she kind of doesn't understand why she's off we, she does understand that she's on holidays but she doesn't understand like you have got to go back to school you don't get more time off and you stay off and then you go back to school um but i think it's just been real confusing especially for like younger kids with all this lockdown stuff it's not so bad to like portia and alfie and oscar and well not mason now because he's finished school um but for the younger ones it's just really hard to get them to understand that you know you, you've got to go to school basically so she was a little bit upset on sunday night and we're just like reassuring her saying you don't have to be upset you don't have to once you get to school you're gonna love it you know you're gonna enjoy being back with your friends playing you know doing the things that you like doing because she loves pe so she loves her best days and mondays and tuesdays because she does pe on them two days so anyway she went to school yesterday and come home and she went i loved school mum and i thought i knew you would so anyway she was fine she's not upset anymore she was a little bit like do we have to go to school again tomorrow she was a little bit upset last night um well, I think because it's been playing on her mind and she's been getting that little bit upset, she keeps saying, oh, God, tummy ache, I need medicine. And it's like, you don't want to say no because she could genu genuinely have stomach ache and be feeling sick because she's worried. And then you don't want to keep giving it up because she could just be playing on that to see whether I'll say, you don't have to go to school tomorrow. So it's just really hard. So what I do is I give her a little bit of medicine and then she's fine. <laughs> just to make her believe that she's had it um and then if she has really got stomach ache then i will ima i would imagine she would carry on crying but she had she didn't i think it was just more the point of i don't want to go to bed and i don't want to go to school so anyway she's fine now so we'll check in with vanellope and then she can tell you if she enjoyed being in school today and then we'll check in with the others see how they're getting on and see how they feel why like, because they go to school now it's just poor shot and oscar going to school now because mason's left he's got time off now until he goes to sixth farm so he goes to sixth farm in september doing business so he's got a, he's got a good you've got a good long holiday haven't you now so you go back to school <laughs> um but yeah anyway we're gonna go and fill a pool up sort that out and then check in with the kids when they get back i hope you are all having an amazing day i'm so glad now that um we can get back to normal well hopefully because apparently 
the lockdown is meant to well it looks like lockdown is not going to be completely over now it looks like it could be july i've got a feeling that they're going to end up putting more restrictions back in place and then it's probably going to be after christmas before everything is lifted that's that's the feeling i get and dave I don't know how everybody else feels about it, um, but they keep trying to sneak things back in, saying, oh, there's a new variant here, and it's growing over there, and stuff like that, so I just kind of get that feeling that we're going to go back into lockdown. Hopefully, fingers crossed, we won't, um, but yeah. Anyway, um, I'm just trying to think if there's anything else. I don't think there is. Anyway, I'm going to love you. I was going to say, I hope you are all having an amazing day. And I was going to say that I'm just really glad now that we can get back to some normality, like working and stuff like that. And yeah, you know what I mean. So I'm going to be over the sh at the studio. Hopefully next week, need to say, I've been saying this for like months and months, say it all the time, really want to get it sorted out. And then I go, it's not that I don't want to sort it out, it's when I get over there, it just, I've not been able to motivate myself and when I get there it's just like I look at it and I think I really haven't got the energy. I just haven't got the energy to drag everything out, sort it all out and just decide what I want to do with it because I really need to get a wall built across the floor because we need the space to be smaller so when we've got babies in it's easy to heat up at the minute we can't do babies there. It's either that or a set up at home to do newborns, which would be better because my bedroom downstairs has got quite good space. Although it's dark, um, I can light it with lights so it still look like day. And it's warm down there. So, or if it's really like a really hot day, it's cool down there. So you can have it either or, which would be better because in the winter in the studio, it's just absolutely freezing. And until we find a beneficial way of heating it up even though we've got the fires obviously we've not used them yet so we, we're not 100% sure whether they are going to heat the studio up to how we want it if you know what I mean so as soon as we because I need to get another one so once we get the other one and we get both of the gas we were able to get hold of the gas because everybody was buying it in lockdown so they were just out of stock but I know some places have started getting it in now so hopefully we can buy the other fire, get them on. Although we don't need them now. <laughs> but once winter comes or it starts getting colder, we can try and see how warm the room gets and how quick and then we'll know like if it's gonna work or whether it's not. But yeah, anyway, I'm gonna love you and leave you and I will see you guys well in about five seconds. <laughs>
them junior school years. I get what you mean, yeah. No, you, no, you're just being an idiot now. I want more nuts. I know we're getting you a blue one. What did you do today? They were £1.50, but we just got them. What did you do today? Yeah. Phonics. They were £1.50. Oh, sweet. Don't get that down to the top. It won't come out. Hold that. Phonics. Too busy trying to open your wallet now, aren't you? Come on, tell the guys quick. Tell them you can tell them what you did in school today. I've got old blueberry on it. Just leave it on there. Um, that's nice and neat. Is it? Um, chronics. No, actually, first I did PA. Hmm. And, um, chronics. Then play. No, actually, after PE was play, and then after PE was play, okay, and then after play, yeah, was phonics, and then we did one more work, and then it was lunch, and then more work, and then play, and then did some. We have to finish off our work and then it's home time. Was it? Yeah. Did you do in school today? Uh, first I did. Um, no, I don't know. You do remember. I won't leave it there, Mel. You don't remember what you did in school. English, math, science, no, reading. Really? Spanish, French. We did English, math, diary reading. Um, yeah, cherry one. That's all I can think of. That's all I need for your dinner today, didn't you? Yeah. Was it nice? Yeah. So now at the kids' school, we have an app and we pick their meals what they want and then they're brought in by the chef to the school so which is better because you can pick what you want can't you you do it for them yeah what do you do in school today english history maths drama and could it feel weird going to school with no mason yeah. hey Do you think it's weird going to school no Mason? No. Or is it quiet? It walks off on us anyway, Does it? It's a big noise, though, isn't it? miles per hour. <laughs> That's my It's so always because he's rushing to go and see his girlfriend before school. No, yeah. he What are you saying? On it. Less you know, less you are going off. This is a medium that was 150? 250. No. Yours was 150. Why was it 150? Yours Just because we had nuts? Yeah. Robbing that. Today, oh. tell them now she's playing in the pool. Be careful. Tell the guys, tell the guys what you're doing. Hey. Today, tell them you help Chloe look after the babies. She's trying to get clever, right? <laughs> hey, water, water. Be careful, you're gonna choke on the water. <laughs> <laughs> Show the guys your pigtails. Whoa, <laughs> show them your hair. Ha <laughs> ha.
<laughs> You're right. Show you guys. Show the guys your pigtails. Say, whoa, look at my pigtails. Oh, well, look at all. Soggy now, aren't they? Okay, so Aurora's washing my hair. Are you washing my hair? No. No, you're not doing it now. Look at your little pigtails. Oh, no. You oh, look so no. cute. I want to end now. You want to do my hair now? Where's the pan gone? Good mum. You doing my hair? Good mum. Come on then. Good mum. You washing my hair? No. Eh? Did you have a good date, nurse? Are you cheating? Are you cheating? Brother John, brother John, can you sing it? Are you cheating? Are you cheating? <laughs> You're so cute, are you? Are you cheating? Are you cheating? She can't get that bit out. She goes tong, tong. <laughs> evil can evil. Clever girl. You gonna go out now and do one? guys I'm over here now at the studio as per usual every night to end today's vlog just look at the sweat on my head it is absolutely roasting and it's set to continue throughout the rest of June at least anyway so I think on the 19th when we had that little something some it's gonna be really really nice at the night time and through the day so with that said and on that bombshell do not forget to smash the like button subscribe if you're not already make sure you click the notification bell it does nothing make sure you leave us a comment if you can and we will see you guys tomorrow because we do this every single day